Okay, we're off. This way... Uh, yeah, this way. <clears throat> Next quest is over here. And then we'll trade in both of them at the same time. Once they're both completed. And then we'll do the story. Machines must have caused a stampede. These machine tracks lead into the ruins, along with human footprints. The ruins. Here we go. We'll follow the tracks into the ruins. Kill the sawtooths. I hear a voice. Two sawtooths, huh? Problem here? How fucking stupid was that? Uh, now they're running away. He phased through the fucking wall. That was incredibly dumb. Oh my god! Now I'm dead. I have no health.
All right. I did it. Fuck. They want me to kill the other one. They want me to kill the other one even though I overrode it. That's lame. They want me to kill it. How do I kill it? There's no way to just kill it. I have to like massacre it. Huh. Got their attention. Now I have to kill it, yeah. It ran right through it and didn't get stunned. Oh my god. I'm dead. You ran right through my trap twice and didn't get stunned. This is so dumb. If I fucking hacked it, why do I have to still kill it? It doesn't make any sense. It makes no fucking sense. I hacked it. It's mine. But then the game says, oh, for the mission, you still have to kill it anyway. Why? Did they not fucking think? Obviously not. They obviously didn't use a fucking brain cell when they made this. It makes no fucking sense at all. Why do I have to still kill them? What's, what's the point of hacking enemies if then you have to kill them anyway for missions? Why did I even bother hacking? on a bunch of traps. Oops. Okay. I'm sorry, this is fucking dumb. It's terrible game design. So you can override them, but then you still have to kill them. <laughs> I'm hitting the fucking weak point. It's not doing any damage. This sucks. How is this good? This is not. This is bad. This is fucking booty right now. I have all these tools and everything, and it still doesn't do anything to them. I'm going to override it, but then I'm going to have to kill it later anyway. Hit. 
killed one, but now to kill the other one, what do I do? I can't just kill it. Hell, I just do I threw a rock. Oops. Fire and terror are its weakness. So I have to kill the stupid thing. How dumb is this? Stop moving! Oh my god, now I can't get a shot. Dude, it won't stop moving. I can't get a shot, it won't stop moving. Now it wants to fight me. Oh my god. Twenty-nine percent resist fire weave. Ugh. Back to your business. Where the hell's this guy? There he is. They're up there. How the fuck do I get up there? Oh look! An audio log. No, it's a notebook. First Amendment Virtual. April 29th, 2063. Last week in one of the biggest synchronized police actions in U.S. history, the homes of more than 700 private citizens were raided. More than 500 arrests were made for the crime of inciting criminal behavior using private informational processes. If you've been paying attention over the past nine years, you know how to parse the above legal word suit. Those raided are accused of participating in a virtual anti-corporate sovereignty rally, this time at the HoloNet headquarters of Sterling Melkeet. <laughs> Watching 500 people, many of them bloodied and terrified, haul from their homes by SWAT bots is understandably and rightfully horrifying to a lot of people, but this is nothing new. The arrest of virtual protesters. Legislation simply hasn't kept up with the advances of the hollow net, and that's no accident. It serves the interest of Sterling Malky and Metallurgic and their corporate ilk to treat the holoscape not as a public space, but in the words of metallurgic-backed Senator Gerald O'Neill, an array of privately owned information and processes. Huh. So people were getting arrested for stuff they were basically saying on the internet, which I guess they're calling the hollow net. It must be a more advanced version of the internet. Okay, where the fuck are they? They're up there. How do I get to them? Uh... How the fuck? I can't climb this. Hey, assholes, come down. How'd they even get up there? I don't even, seriously, I don't even see a way up there. Belongings, primitive tools. Oh, there we You're go. Brave who was outcast. What are you doing here? Your friend Den told me to come find you. Why are you up there? The Sawtooth ripped our packs from us. Uh, uh, me. Us. Without weapons, this was the best we could manage. Thank you so much for destroying it. Now we can get home. One thing. You won't tell anyone you saw us here, will you? I didn't. At least, not your friend. Need any help getting down? We'll go back on our own. Don't take this the wrong way, but... Maybe we shouldn't be seen with you, or they might figure us out. Alright. Return to Den. So, yes, yeah, so I gotta return back to uh, the town and trade in these two quests. Yep. 
Yep, the town is where both quests get turned in, so where's my mount? Here it comes. Just like Red Dead Redemption, it comes right up to you. Alright. Let's go, let's go trade in these two quests. And then we can continue with the story. Other side of town? I don't know. I never got that far to the gate or that close to the gate before. Trading these missions. Should have got out of this There we go. I found your friends. You know where? They'll be back shortly. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you! What a relief! You won't tell anyone, will you? No, <laughs> you won't tell Relax. anyone. The matriarchs are up singing the hymn of atonement. I think you're safe. You're right. The hymn atones for all of us. Thank you. That's not what I meant, but okay. <laughs> Curiosities. Okay, here. done. Now where's the other mission? Trade in. She saved many lives. The tribe is lucky to have her. Oh, fine, Sona. Where is she up here? Whoa, she's up at the top of the mountain. I didn't even know you could climb up this. What's she doing up here? <clears throat> She'll give me a workout to treat in my quest. <laughs> the crap up here, look. Yeah, this is useful. Got a raccoon skin. I could upgrade with that. Yeah, I could upgrade one of my capacities, I believe. And you brought the signal arrows to warn? I did. Kind of hope he never has to use them, though. We stand agreed. It is a poor war chief who has a craving for war. For now, all I ask of our braves is that they are ready. I thank you for your aid. All right. Generous reward box. There we go. And wasn't there one here that needed a raccoon skin? I need fox skins, by the way. I should start looking for those. I gotta get the traps. So I haven't even used the trap yet. This one needs no, I'm using raccoon bone. Ah, uh, not raccoon skin, raccoon bone. Fox bone, boar bone. I gotta start killing animals for the further upgrades. Okay. Alright, so that's it. We've done all the side content except for the, uh, what do you call it? The, the stupid tr uh, training, right? Hunting grounds. It says I'm not even high level enough to do it yet. Or the these, the silly trainings on these, which I'm probably not gonna do, so. I think I'm gonna do the main mission, Secret at the Gates. Can I rappel down? Yes. My trusty mount. Very 
Very nice. All right, so where are we headed? Two different areas here into the corrupted zone, right? What does the mission entail that I do? Clear corrupted zones. I have to clear two of them. One's here and one is far to the west. I see. Metal flower, Bannock figure. These are the maps that I bought. Yeah, the maps that I bought revealed these items. I see. So there's two level 15 corrupted zones I need to clear out in order to progress with the story. So I guess that's what I'm going to do next.